Hi, Reserve Women. Here is your week one how to read your Bible Bible study quick recap. So in week one, we learned a few different things. First of all, we learned that the Bible is actually God's word to his people. We learned the Bible is not a self-help book or a guide to quick fixes, but it does tell us who we are and what we should do through the lens of who God is. We looked at Hebrews 4.12 and we saw that the Bible is alive and active, it's moving, and so therefore it's relevant in our lives today. We also looked at a couple verses in 2 Timothy and we learned what the Bible actually does, what it's useful for. And uh, some of the things highlighted here in this verse are teaching, rebuking, correcting, training, and the word equipped. And so the scriptures, as we learn them, it teaches us what we are to do to carry out the works that God has planned for us. We also looked at a few verses in the book of James, and we realized that if our ultimate goal is to be like God, we simply cannot read his word and forget it because his word is a reflection of who he is. And so the more we read it, the more we get to know about God's character. We introduced our study method, which is basically this. We pray first. We ask God to show us what he wants us to learn from his word. We observe what we're reading. So we ask questions like, what does it say? What do I notice about these verses? What stands out to me? And then we go ahead and we interpret what we're reading. So we use tools like our footnotes in our Bibles. Maybe we'll read different translations. Maybe we watch some of the Bible project videos being sent out. We ask questions. We look at the context of the scripture. And then lastly, we apply it to our lives. And so we ask these questions. What do I learn about God? And what do we learn about what we should do through the lens of who God is? So a few things to remember today is the Bible is living and active. And when we read scripture with the knowledge that the book is about God, we can apply what it says to our daily modern lives, helping us to live out the work that he has called us to do. So a big question that you guys had last night is where do I start? Next week, we're going to come back and we're going to learn about how to build a Bible reading routine. But before then, I would just encourage you in this and start small. Remember, we said one bite at a time. The good news is, is that you can read this. You can do this. And God has given us incredible access to his word and who he is through the Bible. And he wants you to know him through it. That is really good news. So I would encourage you today to just start with reading your homework there. Start with doing one thing at a time. And when we come back on Monday, we'll talk about building a routine. We're also going to come back and learn about the Pentateuch, which are the first five books of the Bible. So we're going to look at Genesis, Exodus, Leviticus, Numbers, and Deuteronomy and see how these books work together as a whole in the bigger story of God.